Hey guys, Justin here, and finally I can get another daily vlog out for you guys. Today is enjoying my day in Perth city centre. So there are two places I want to go, then I will be going to eat lunch, plus watch a movie, which of course I won't be filming. And then the next section will be taking the ferry to end the day. So first spot is the Art Gallery of Western Australia, but the unfortunate is that I'm at the wrong spot, so I need to walk back up first, so I'll see you guys in a second. Alright, here we are. Made it to the spot, and uh, let's head in there real fast. It is free of charge, but I need to show my proof of vaccination, so see you guys in a second. Alright, made it into this art gallery. Now, we're not going to be filming a lot because it's just, I don't want to make this uh, video too long. It's just going to be compact with so many of these freaking artworks. I don't really want to like go through it through the video. So I'm just going to do like one to two minutes when I walk around and I'll show you the photos through a Google Drive. So you can see all of these. Okay. I don't know what's going on with my phone today. It just keeps like not focusing. Now there's also already one thing already I really like this place. Is I can enjoy the air con in here. Oh my gosh, it's so nice. This is how this area goes. And now there will be a lot more areas on top. I'll be walking through it way more carefully through the day, so no worries. This is free of charge size one. Oh, there's a cool one over here. What is that? Oh, it's just someone got his uh, leg stabbed with a uh, spear. Ooh. Can't really see too much in this area, so we'll head up to the top and then we'll walk around at the top and we'll have a quick loop around just for the video, just to loop around quickly. Okay, there's a lot of galleries. So actually a lot of floors, so Oh, cover my nose. Oh. All right, so done with my visit. And I actually honestly do enjoy this one because, uh, of course, besides the air con. <laughs> And I think the uh, artworks in there are very cool because they are mostly some, somewhat related to the Aboriginal and the Indigenous people artwork. They have a lot of them over there. And uh, they mostly uh, put in some of the uh, artworks that are drawn by the Indigenous people. So it's actually very cool looking. And that's why the uh, details, the photos that I, take, that I took is in the description down below. The uh, Google Drive should be down there so you can check it out. Now on to the next spot. And I have arrived at the next spot, which is WA Museum Bulabadip. And uh, it's another museum, so we're just going to walk in there and I'll take some photos and you can check out the Google Drive afterwards. Alright, into the museum and I'm just going to show you this part because... Holy train documentary! Oh, it's an object and scan the barcode. I just randomly made one. Forest Farm. Cool. Crate with supplies. Charcoal iron. Dusk Master Polish. That's a lot of things around here. That's actually very far away. I'm actually all the way over there and I can actually still go ahead and actually get it. 
connected. That's pretty fun. Okay, if I can actually, I don't know how to put this thing back in. I thought it should be like this, but apparently it's not working, so I just kind of put it randomly. This is the reflections part. There's still two more levels. I'm very worried that I don't have all of the time I need to actually complete everything before the movie. So I'm just going to show you this section, and I'm going to take other things with the photos. Yeah, this is a very cool place right here. Now we'll do the uh, conclusion afterwards. Just gonna show you a little bit, not gonna show you everything. All right, so I'm done with that museum. Of course, I don't call myself I actually finished visiting that museum because I'm running out of time. So, but I did take quite a few photos and I did go through all of the areas. Which just basically, this is a museum that explains all the overall of Western Australia. This is the Museum of Western Australia. It shows you the history, some of the history of the indigenous cultures and then the changes to the landscapes throughout the years. And then we have talking about some of the wildlife and some of the origins inside, like uh, about our water systems and how to deal with that. And also some of the wildlife with the water animals and some of the history animals with some of the bones inside. It's actually very cool. So check out the photos down there. I've taken some of them and uh, you guys can experience that. Now on to the lunch, but first, I'm actually going to be going over to take one of the train videos for you guys, so you should have watched it already. So if you guys have not watched that, remember to go back and watch it. Then, no, next scene will be lunchtime, and uh, for that one, hopefully I can show you guys something cool. Alright, I'm done with my Perth Stadium Express train filming. Now I'm heading over to the Chinatown slash China Block, what I call it. Because uh, the Perth Chinatown is not even a town, it's just a little block with two to three restaurants but I'm actually going over there not eating uh, Chinese food I'll be going over there to eat Japanese ramen because so. <laughs> that restaurant I visited before and uh, I like it quite a lot so so I'll see whether yeah, we're just gonna go in. It's quite far away from my cinemas. I need to go. I actually need to hurry up because my movie starts at 2.15 and usually it starts 15 minutes late just because it allows you to get in at 2.15. It's, uh, it's at the front over there. Is it open though? No one is actually waiting. I guess we'll see. Uh, are you Japanese? えっと、鶏醤油ラーメンって。えっと、片沢片麺と全部が大丈夫です。ネギが入って、だけど竹の子なしで大丈夫ですか。はい。次がえっと餃子が今日ありますか。片麺ですね。はい、大丈夫です。はい。餃子ありますね、今日は。はい、じゃあはい。はい。えっと、飲み物がありますか。ラムネ。ラムネあります。あ、ラムネで。はい。はい、これでいいです。28でね。はい、ちょっと待って
Holy show you ramen. In English, it's gonna be uh, chicken soy sauce based ramen. So, this is a, a one from Kyushu, a ramen restaurant from Kyushu, and it's famous for having chicken instead of pork. A very soft and not soft noodles. I always like to have the harder noodles, but the flavor is just so gentle and I like it a lot. With my favorite drink, Ramune, it's just perfect. And here we go. Dumplings. This is necessary for me every single time when I eat ramen. Gyoza, and I got five pieces. It seems pretty good. Here we go. Get some of the spicy sauce, I think. Noodles finish and one last one. And for our last stop, I will be taking the ferry, but the ferry is there, so I need to run. I don't know how they actually pay for this thing. It departs in 4.30 because now it's 4.29 or something like that, so let's get in there. I think we pay on board. Yep, here we go. First time ever taking the Transper Ferry and uh, there will be only one style for the ferry which is from Elizabeth Key across to Main Street where Turf Zoo is. Here goes the ferry. Just, just to make the video interesting, we're going to be filming the full journey on the boat.
the boat ride will be around eight minutes. I hope I actually don't drop my phone into the water. That would be that would be miserable. Oh man, a perfect ending for today. A ferry ride across the road, across the ocean. Of course, I do need to take buses back later on. It's gonna be 34, I need to wait for it, but yeah, having a lot of fun today. I'm gonna to edit the video and hopefully I can premiere tonight. No worries, I'm not putting my phone outside. I'm just putting it right like here. So that I can actually see most of the views outside. Oh my gosh, today the, the, the sky is actually very good up here. Not very good over that way though. <laughs> holding my phone very tightly just in case it's gonna drop into the water. If it's drop into the water, never can I get it back. Just finished watching Morbius for the uh, for my movie Morbius. This is a Marvel movie, and I is, I if I rate it, it will be seven out of ten. Yeah, not gonna spoil anything. But later on, when the uh, 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 the cinemas in Hong Kong maybe they will reopen, hopefully you guys can still watch it. If not, just go online and watch it. Oh man, this is so enjoyable. Perfect spot to do our outro as soon as we get off or end the video. Today is a very fun day, a little bit rushed due to the fact that I need to hurry up to get onto my uh, movie schedule. Movie schedule. But uh, I have a lot of fun in the, in the city today with the uh, areas up top. The two museums that I've never been to, they're a lot of fun and they're free of charge. So of course later on I can go back and uh, explore deeper. Today I just very quickly go through. It's still a lot of fun. You guys can still see the photos down at the bottom so remember to check that one out. And uh, a quick ramen Japanese conversation recorded for you guys. So, And we ended up with our ferry ride. This is a lot of fun. So hope you guys will be enjoying today's life, uh, uh, daily live vlog. Greatly appreciate if you guys have some support me throughout it for my time here in Perth slash WA. And uh, yeah, 
course more videos will be uploaded very, very frequently so not very frequently like weekly so remember to stay tuned and subscribe join the family we're very close to 750 subscribers when we hit 750 subscribers i'm going to start and do one of the uh, subscriber specials and then we're gonna update the subscriber special list We're arriving on the other side at Main Street. We're almost there. Does this guy actually needs to turn the whole way around? What the hell? Oh, I actually understand. We're gonna exit at the front. <laughs> We're not gonna exit on the side. We're gonna exit on the front. So basically, this guy's just gonna crash onto the onto the land. Yeah, just gonna run straight onto it. Yep, run straight and then we'll exit at the front. Oh no, we're just gonna exit on the side, okay. Okay, that's pretty stupid. Thank you so much for watching this Lady Life vlog. I hope you guys enjoyed. Remember to like and subscribe, click the bell so that you can get notifications when I post. Remember to check out the previous two special Armadale Line videos. If you guys have not watched that one, remember to go back. Check out the links in the description down below for my other channels and my Instagram. Click on these videos up top. And we're getting out. Do I need to tack off? I have no idea whether I need to tack off or not. Oh, I do. I do need to tack off. Peace!